this is likely going to be Big Ben's last home game. Are we going to see the, the, the Steelers air it out, uh, like for Ben or, or Mayfield? Like, what's a, what's a quarterback prop that you guys like tonight? Jeff? Uh, I mean, I think just going over on Big Ben's touchdown props is fine. Uh, I mean, I'd be pretty shocked if, if they didn't give him, you know, multiple chances inside the red zone to do that. He's plus 100 to go over 1.5 passing touchdowns. I think that's great value. Uh, again, I, I mean, I, I think we're going to get a Cleveland Browns defense. It's not going to be, a, it's not really at 100% anyways. And I, I think this game could just get out of control at some point. I mean, you know, we mentioned guys like Kareem Hunt. I, I just don't know what the motivation here is for Cleveland to play these guys in the second half. So I, I think that going over on, on Big Ben's touchdown prop, again, if you're if you're really focusing just on his singular props, just on Ben, go over the, the 1.5 touchdowns because Pittsburgh's not a good rushing team anyways. And the one thing the Browns do do and probably will do good tonight is, is bottle up the runs. So, yeah, if you like Pittsburgh, and again, they switch to favorites and you like Big Ben, that's that's great value you're getting at plus 100. All right, Pierce could also uh, get after the over half an interception prop. How dare you? Actually, I probably won't go in that route, given that Cleveland, they've already got several of their guys in secondary are out. Others I don't think are going to play. They've had a good secondary this season in Cleveland, but I just don't think they're going to suit up. And if they do, I believe that they're going to be limited. We also have reason to believe that their pass rush is going to be limited. So I don't even know if I would go with that interception. But I'm definitely going to go with over 234 and a half passing yards. I just don't see the last game in Pittsburgh handing the ball off to three yard per carry Najee Harris all game. And, and if anyone needs rest, it's Harris. The workload they've given him in his rookie season, we already talked about it was criminal to get Chubb out there running and wearing him down in a meaningless game. Why wear down Najee Harris any more than you already have? You need to save this guy. He's probably one of the, I mean, he's basically your future. So why go out there and burn him out? I mean, you don't even need an offensive coordinator tonight. Here's what's going to happen. It's going to be Ben Roethlisberger audibling in the shotgun and passing every single down. Yep. Yep. I love it. I love uh, you mentioning he's going to need Tommy John after this. He's going to throw the ball 90 times. Uh, AJ, is there a quarterback prop you like tonight? Well, actually, Emerson, you hit on it. It's, it's the interception prop, I think, for both guys. And look, if Ben comes out and he's throwing 90 times or even 50 times like one of them's going to somebody else on the other team there's just no chance if you really think he's going to throw the ball that many times there's almost no chance he doesn't throw an interception here you get him at even money to throw a pick i like mayfield as well at minus 135 to to throw one here had a really bad last game uh and and has struggled all year with interceptions so i i do think both of those are in play tonight 